In this video I will show you how to download shaders to Minecraft. You might be bored of the old plain look of the game and this will make it so much better. To be able to use shaders you will need to download Optifine which basically helps optimize your game and allows you to use shaders. To do that we will need to close Minecraft and go over to our browser. Now after we have gotten into our browser we select one of the search boxes and we write Optifine. Then press the enter button and open up the website at the top. Now once you get here, you go over to downloads and you download the version that you want to by pressing show all versions or you just download the latest one. For me it's 1.20.1 .1, but for you in the future it might be different. If you want to support the creators of Optifine, we strongly encourage you to press the download button which will run a quick ad before downloading. But right now since we are doing a video, we will just press the mirror button which sends you to the download website directly. And right here we press the download button. The download will begin automatically and after it's finished you can either minimize your browser or close it. Now after you have done that, go over to the bottom and open up the file explorer application, then go into downloads, take the file that you just downloaded and drag it over to your desktop. Now we can close this and right here double left click and open up the installer of Optifine. When running Optifine you might run into problems like the installer not opening or it might be opening up in a folder. To fix all of that you can just download Java or if you already have it just download the latest version. To do that you can just go over to java.com then press download java and run the installer. The installation process should be pretty simple. Another thing is if you have the latest version of java it just might open up in a different application. To fix that just right click then press open with and at the top you should select java but if it doesn't appear at the top just press more apps, scroll down, find java, select it then tick this box, always use this app to open up .jar files and press the OK button. If you still have issues running the installer after downloading Java, you might need to do something called the jar fix, for which there will be a guide in the description. Now after you have gotten right here, Optifine should automatically locate your Minecraft installation folder and just press the install button. And as you can see Optifine is successfully installed. Now after you have installed Optifine, open up your browser. And when you get right here, open up a new tab, then search for the exact shader pack that you want to use. The installation is the same for every one of them. For me, I'll use Silder's shaders because I think they look really good. And I'll open up the link at the top. Once I get into the website, I navigate to the left and press the downloads button. Then right here, you can choose different versions of the shaders. If you have a if you have a lower end PC, choose the light version. If you have better PCs, just select one of the better options such as medium, high or extreme. Now I'll just download light, then press the download button. If you had a pop-up blocked in the top right, that means that your ad block is blocking this redirect. Just right click the download button and press open link in new tab. Then you will be redirected to this website. Be careful about clicking on the ads because they're just ads, they're not the download button. And after a few seconds in the top right, escape button will appear. Press that button and you will be redirected to CurseForge. When you get right here, just go over to the download button right here and press it. Then the download will begin in a couple of seconds. Be careful about the ads right here as well. They're not the download button, they're just ads. And after the download is finished, you can close your browser. The next thing that we can do is open up File Explorer, go into Downloads, then drag out the shaders pack to your desktop and once you have done that you can run Minecraft. Here we are inside of the Minecraft launcher, just go over to this button right here, press it and make sure you select Optifine. Then press the play button and right here you will need to agree to the risk of running a modded version of Minecraft, just press this box and press play. Now after we have gotten inside of Minecraft, just go over to Options. Then you will go over to video settings and in the bottom left you will see Optifine. That means that it's working. Now you can go into shaders right here and when you get into shaders press shaders folder. Then the shaders folder will open up and you can just drag in the shaders pack you just downloaded into this folder and close the folder. And as you can see it just appeared inside of Minecraft. Just press it and Minecraft will reload to install the shader pack. Now once you have selected the shader pack, on the right you can edit settings related to the shader pack and also you can go into shader options and edit a lot more options related to the shader. Now let's jump into a world to show you how it works. 
And here we are back inside of Minecraft. As you can see, it looks beautiful. Let me zoom into some of the details. As you can see, the leaves are moving. The sky looks very good. And basically, we have made Minecraft 10 times better than it already was. That is it for this video. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.